What's up, YouTube? It's your boy JP coming at you again with another video. So today we'll be talking about a portfolio. So we haven't really done portfolios and artwork in a while because it's very rare for them to come in. But this one's a long awaited for a lot of people have been waiting for this Mar Marvel portfolio, Mark Brooks. I, I, I really like this cover too. I dig it. What do you think about it, David? Yeah, it's nice. I think it's the same one in the poster yeah, that we so have. Yeah, so we have a big old painting or a poster right here as well. Just haven't hung it up yet because, you know, Dave is kind of lazy. <laughs> <laughs> this is a black and white, though. This one is, is uh, yeah. really cool. And I really like the ones right here where you have the Crocan, whatever it says, their, yeah. their language. Because there's one with the English and there's one with their actual language. So that's really cool. I dig it. All right. So, but before we get started on this portfolio, you can always win a $25 gift card. All you have to do is be a subscriber, leave a comment down below, and we'll let you guys know in the description, not at the end of the video, but in the description. All right. And we have our What Not Sale coming this Sunday. What's the day on Sunday 27? Yes. This Sunday. So we have the House of X lot. We have Punisher lot. Um, Mighty Morphin and Power Ranger lot. Captain America lot. East of West. The War. A bunch of lots. And maybe we'll throw in some lots as well, like Invincible, Berserk. Oh, we'll, we'll make it like a lot holiday or something, you know? <laughs> okay, so stay tuned for that. You can find us at Whatnot. It's a mobile app for those of you guys that don't know what it is. Download it on your phone. You can type in our name, Organic Price Book, without an S. And then you can find us. And we, when we get a thousand followers, we'll be giving away an Infinity Gauntlet box set as well. Yes. All right, so let's go into this portfolio. As you can tell with the thumbnail, I was pretty giddy for it. I'm getting more into artwork and Mark Brooks art for X-Men was really cool. So um, this is a bit different. So usually when I open portfolios, especially the DC portfolios, it's just attached to the book, but this one's actually comes separated. So you have a little kind of like comes into like a folder, I guess That's yeah. what you call it a little pocket and you have the artwork right here. So we'll take a look at each one of them together. So oh, here's, oh, let me get a little bit closer. All right. Okay. So what is this? All the Fantastic Four? So you have four on them. And yeah, I don't know who this guy is. Because if you have the, th well, you have the thing, and you have this guy with the helmet, but you have this one over there. I don't know what they are. Yeah, so I, I don't know a lot of Marvel characters, but I appreciate the artwork. I really like the style. It's very, what is it? It looks a bit glossy. Yeah. Stands out a little bit. And then on the back, you just have the white, the, you know, the white pages. So you could definitely frame all of these mm -hmm. if you want and just put them everywhere. This is one of my favorite pieces so far that I saw. So I only saw these two and we're going to go through every one of them together. Um, but this one's really cool. Everybody likes Psylocke's. Yeah. So I dig I like it. the cherry blossoms. Yeah, That's the, cher really cool. the cherry blossoms are really cool. You have, so this one actually goes sideways. You have Captain nice. America. Are these like fighting each other, like the, uh, the Avengers vs. X-Men or something, or what's going on right here? I don't know, it looks like the world is exploding behind them. Yeah, but you know, these are just really cool. Let us know in the comments as well, which one is your favorite. Oh, uh, that's a cool one. Yeah, this one is dope. I really like it. You have what, Panthers, all of them are Panthers, is that a lion? Yeah. Okay, cool, cool, cool. This one is actually one of my favorite covers. I think this is like what evil evil captain marvel or something yes. like that I, I even have a single issue of her somewhere as well a virgin variant so it's really cool to have this um let me know if you guys read this storyline when she's she, like captain marvel was evil let it let us know if it was a good uh good read because i definitely want to pick it up only because the cover was really cool we have oh very nice this one's really sweet as well yeah spider-man venom <coughs> right here sideways um yeah dig it how you like the Spider-Man costume for this one? Because he always That's has cool. different costumes. I don't like. I don't think I like the lenses for it. It's too the lens, too shiny. Yeah, yeah. I That's like, just me though. <laughs> I really like the Loki one. The Loki one was really cool, especially when it was on the omnibus. But it's like this one looks so modern and everything. And when you open up the Loki volume one or it's, two omnibus, it's, it's like a Silver Age. Yeah, it's very uh, older style. So I, it threw me off for a little bit. <laughs> yeah, he does a lot of detail on his stuff. I yeah. really like that. Yeah, I really like the detail, the attention to the detail, the swords, all the weapons and everything. Yeah, it's very cool. This is one of my favorite covers of all time that I've seen. I mean, you see it on the freaking poster that I have. Right. I should I should get the color version. I should get all the versions. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, this is definitely one of my favorite. I heard this is not all the mutants, but a pretty good amount of them. Right. I'm pretty sure somebody made 
an extended one somewhere and then it has every single unit you can think of. If you guys remember what that is, definitely send us a link or, uh, you know, show us what it is because I've been, I forgot about it. But this one's definitely my favorite besides Psylocke. <laughs> we have Iron Man over here. What do you think about this Iron Dude, Man Dude, this is so cool because of the back, how it's like this, obviously he's like in space. <clears throat> but it makes him stand out. So the black and like the black and white and blue of the space mm -hmm. makes his costume like jump out of, up on the on the paper. It, it looks really cool. Yeah, that's definitely really cool. We have Iron Man statues, and then somebody told me that we have a new um, Diamond exclusive di um, Spider Man statue. I mean Iron Man statue coming out really soon. We're gonna put that up for pre order. Nice. It looks really sweet. Is this uh, Captain America. <laughs> yeah, <clears throat> very realistic. We it got... almost reminds me of um, Alex Ross style. Yeah. Yeah, it's really yeah. cool. I dig it. And then we have uh, the Falcon as Captain America, right? Yes. And then who are these? Just Avengers or? Yeah, it looks like it. Just kind of, I guess, different heroes in his, in the shadow of his wings. It's really cool. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, it is his wings. Ah, that's really neat. <laughs> that's cool. I dig it. And it's like in the universe, I guess. Yeah. That's really cool. And this is in the city. You got, what, Cloak and Dagger? Yep. That's really cool. And then we have Oof. 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 The, the woman of X-Men. You. you got Phoenix, you got, what's this, Rogue? Yep. And then we have Psylocke. Of course she would be in the middle. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> so that's really cool. So these are all of the, um, should I lay it out on the table? Yeah, let's do that. That'd be cool. Yeah, so these are so all, all of it them. together. So I'll lay it out flat on the table so you guys could see it all together. If you guys were to get this portfolio, which one you, would you hang up on the wall? Which one would you be like, ah, it could be back in the portfolio. Let me know. Definitely for me, what I would hang up for sure is all the mutants, you know? Yeah. Uh, see if I can lay them out properly so you guys can see. This is one of my favorites. Out of all of these, which one would, would you say is your favorite, David? Mm. Hold on, let me. Put this one because this one's like yeah. That. Oh, that and we got this last one right here. This All right. All right, uh, guys. I really like this. The Iron Man one is all is the one who that's attracted me the most. Yeah. Uh, all of them are like the detail on them is amazing on all of them. Seriously, yeah. The guys, like even though you're seeing it on here, like it doesn't do justice until you actually see it. Yeah. In person and like I said, you could definitely hang these up as posters. Uh, this Black Panther one to me is so cool, just because the gold and the black looks really cool. But this one with all the X-Men is, is really, it's, I like all of them that are in there. Like they all like, I, I know you guys all hate each other, but let's take a picture. You're like, fine, let's all go sit down <laughs> on this bench behind Magne uh, behind <laughs> Professor X. <laughs> Uh, I really like how they have Magneto right here and how massive he is compared to, you know, <laughs> that guy is swole, He man. got swole, he's he, uh, jacked. He doesn't skip leg day. No, he does or not. Or upper body body. <laughs> hey, uh, Professor X, this is why you don't skip leg day, so you can stand up during the picture. Oh, ah! that's brutal. <laughs> that's mean. No, but that side like one, you're right, it's so yeah. nice, especially with the cherry blossom. Yeah, it's I really like cool. the cherry blossoms in it. Yeah, dang, this is really cool, guys. So as you can see, all those are included in the, uh, the what is it called again? The portfolio, the, the portfolio. Mark Brooks, the Marvel portfolio, Mark Brooks. Yeah. Okay. All right. Real quick, David has something to say about the uh, the poster itself. Yes. So they are thicker. Um, if you if you've handled a poster like a regular poster that you hang up on the wall, these are actually thicker. So uh, as you can see, even even just holding it, if you see right here where my hand is, you can see how thick it is. And it almost feels like an actual painting. So when you grab it right here, like it feels like they actually painted it. So it definitely, you get a really good quality material and artwork whenever you get these. Um, so just be aware of that. It's not like a flimsy poster. Like this is actually like thick. Like look, if I grab it like that, it's thick. Yeah. You can see. Oh, oh, oh. There you, <laughs> you see? So it's thick. <laughs> and then also inside the portfolio you can see each one what it is so it, it, it labels it out for you all right by mark brooks each one and all that good stuff as well that's so cool you, so you guys can know where it came from and all that good stuff oh yeah and one thing we forgot to mention uh we have a tiktok now oh, and yeah. a discord <laughs> oh yeah we do have a discord and a tiktok I'll, I'll be leaving that in our link tree link so you can definitely check click on that 
and you know check us out david will be running the tiktok so i don't even have access to it <laughs> <laughs> so you guys can always chat with him on tiktok he's he's obsessed with tiktok now you know <laughs> he's like yeah i'll be on there for like maybe 10 minutes and like three hours later it's like oh crap it's like 3 a.m i still gotta go to sleep that's why he's always showing up late for work <laughs> but anyways yeah so you can pick this up let us know which one's your favorite portfolio too because there are other ones like art germ and uh, um art germ portfolio as well yeah. i think that one's sold out we do have some that we can showcase just to show you guys what it looks like if you guys are interested in let us know in the comments and then you can pick us up this one up at organicpricebooks.com and i'll see you guys in the next video